So here we are in Banff, Alberta. There's a big problem in Banff. It needs to be saved. So today we're going on a trip via the Cowboy Trail. So we're in Nobleford, Granham. We're in Fort McLeod today, Cardston, Alberta. The escarpment of Chief Mountain. Welcome to Mount View, Alberta. Painter Creek has so much history. So we're in Longview, Alberta. Black Diamond, great place, very historical. Welcome to Millerville. Turner Valley, what a beautiful place. So here we are, we're in Banff, Alberta, and I'm gonna show you some stuff that you might find interesting. Come with me. What a spectacular, spectacular park. Banff National Park of Canada. But it's got some problems. And one of the problems is this. Normally, normally, when you see those old growth forests with the long pole and then the nice canopy at the top, those sustained fire cycles when they were young and then fire cycle 30 years, 40 years, another one, another one, and that canopy grew and grew and grew, that tree didn't burn because there wasn't enough fuel around it for the tree to burn. Well, look at this. This should be 60 feet of just straight log. Instead, it's brush right down to the ground. And look at this. Look at how thick and thatch this is. This tree in any fire, grass fire, wildfire, this tree is dead. It will not make it. What needs to happen is we need to simulate mother nature. So we need to bring her back to the range that she historically operated at. So a tree like this is susceptible to fire. So why not do what mother nature would have done with these fires and raise the skirt 60 feet, still having a canopy, and then burning this all up so you get the micronutrients in the soil that this tree feeds off of. But right now, this is just another burnt tree in Banff National Park. But with the help of people and machinery and the right equipment and the right philosophy, we can turn this ship around and start doing something where this park can be now saved. Because right now, it is in a lot of trouble. And in this tour through Banff, I'm gonna show you really interesting things. 